guys, I'm Megan. Uh, today I wanted to talk a little bit about the deadlift and the setup for it, the mechanics, and the best way to do so without hurting yourself. Um, so step up to my barbell. Just like any good lift, you want to start with a good foundation. So I start with my feet right underneath my hips. Um, typically when we deadlift, we want to have the weight as close to our body as possible. We like to feel the steel. So I'm going to roll that barbell up against my shins. And then from here, I'm going to make sure my hips are in a good position. So. Typically when I'm setting up, I would like to just put my hips back and then I make sure my knees are just right over my feet still. So I'm stacking my bones, ankle, knee, and then my hip, I'm just putting it back. My chest will be over the barbell, like so. Then I'm going to pick the barbell up and all I'm doing, I'm gonna make sure to have a neutral neck and then I'm going to press through the floor using my arms just as hooks. And then set it back down. So pretty simple, um, there's not really much to that. A couple things that you do wanna make sure to do is uh, brace your belly. So as obviously this is 65 pounds, not much there. However, as they get heavier, as your lifts get heavier, you'd like to brace your belly down, make sure it feels like you're wearing a belt inside of your skin. Um, other than that, you just wanna make sure to breathe the entire time, especially if you're repping out the deadlift rather than just doing one rep. Um, but yeah, that's it, happy deadlifting.